right hand technique uh, for me I kind of think about it from a drummer's perspective um, I think of I don't I don't think of it I don't try to think yeah I'm gonna you know hit this downstroke upstroke and then mute the next one or whatever I listen to like whatever drum groove is then you know uh, you know it's, like, it's kind of like the old guys like Steve Ray Vaughan, they did it, you know, it's kind of, you know, very percussive sort of thing. Um, if I, you know, if I play the, the standard kind of shuffle or whatever, like the Stevie thing was. So, um, yeah, so I think of it as like a drummer, you know, I'd maybe take even two notes, you know. Now, on its own, it sounds very boring, but if you, you know, if you cover it in, uh, you know, mute in between. And then if you do it, again, same thing, only you just kind of rick the strings with, you know. And you've instantly got that whole kind of, you know, shuffly thing going on. Um... Otherwise, I you know as I said, I I do relate to drummers. You know, if a drummer's playing a grave, and I go, oh, that sounds quite good. I maybe go. <laughs> kind of thing because the drummer could be going don't don't die don't don't die you know you know that kind of thing and, and I, I'm not afraid to be I don't know better word I don't know noisy with it you know because that's what it's all about you know it's like you know you can you can play all that kind of stuff you know with this hand, I, I, to do all that kind of thing for me, I just, it has to be very relaxed sort of thing, you know, and you just, I generally try not to think of what I'm actually playing, you know, am I playing this mute here, this mute here, this one here, off, on, I just kind of go, oh, that sounds like, you know, and uh, I just try to copy it, you know, it's all, most, most of the way I play is really all by, you know, ear, that kind of thing, um, you know, it's the same with if I play, uh, you know, just a basic rhythm or a chord, you know, if you're playing an a, a major, you know, uh, just a bar chord. There's, you can do it that way. Or you can just, you know, mess with it, you know. Because you can do so much with one chord, you know, people seem to forget. Some people just get, you know, well, just play it pretty simple. So, you know, and just... It's really all about your, you know, your right hand. You just, you know, you, sometimes I sit and practice for him just... I'm not even using my left hand, it's just as, I'm only using it as a mute. So I was <laughs> Sounds really annoying, but you know, <laughs> nobody's listening, <laughs> so it's just me in the house. So, yeah, and then you just, you can, uh, I've actually incorporated, incorporated that into um, just lead stuff as well. You know, I maybe play. <laughs> So you can incorporate it in everything really so. <laughs> <laughs>